Hey guys, this is Owen with Seek Outside. So today I'm going to be going over two tents, um, the advantages of them. It's going to be the Red Cliff and the six person teepee. Okay, first I'd like to go over some specs. So this, uh, this Red Cliff right here comes in at four pounds, 14 ounces. That's with a carbon pole and the stakes. Uh, it's going to stand six foot, 10 inches tall. So there's room in there to stand. Um, another great thing about this tent is it's good for six people, um, three people with a stove keep you warm. It's kind of the ideal tent to have for your do it all. Okay guys, so the Red Cliff is a great tent for six people. Um, three people with a stove is awesome as well. Uh, it stands at six foot 10 inches. So as you can see, I have room in here to stand up. I'm uh, six foot tall. So there's plenty of room in here. Um, it's an awesome tent for anybody who's trying to go the lighter route and still have a tent that's great for a lot of people. So yeah, anyways, the Red Cliff is super awesome. Definitely recommend it for people trying to count some ounces and still have a bigger tent. Okay guys, so this is the six person teepee. This comes in at six and a half pounds, so six pound, eight ounces um, with the aluminum pole and the stakes. If you take the carbon pole, you're gonna have roughly 11 ounces less. So you're gonna get down in that high five pound range. Uh, this is a super awesome tent. So some differences that set it aside, it is in all technicality, a bigger tent. Square footage is more than the Red Cliff itself. However, the Red Cliff does use its space a little bit better. Um, this is a lot taller, I believe eight inches to a foot taller. So there's tons of room in here. Um, you can kind of stand where you'd like. Um, it makes you pretty happy. You're never gonna feel really cramped in here. Um, other than that, yeah, no, it's an awesome tent. It comes in at a little bit more weight. It's the teepee shape everybody loves. Um, it's gonna shear off wind really well. It's gonna pitch super tight. All in all, it's a super great tent. Um, both of them are gonna be awesome for whatever your needs are. This is also gonna sleep six people, um, three people with a stove. So some key features about the Red Cliff, it's gonna come with six guy out loops. That's not including the ones that are on the door. So you can create a lot of extra space in there, kind of give yourself some more headroom when you're sleeping. It also comes with 14 stake out loops. Um, my theory with our tents is as well as you have them staked in is as well they're gonna do in the wind. Um, so no matter the, if you have it staked out really well, it's gonna do amazing. So that's some other features to go over. Um, as far as adding door screens, it only adds eight ounces on the Red Cliff um, versus the 11 ounces to add them on the six person. And that's just gonna to happen to do with uh, door height um, and the amount of material used for that. Okay, so some key features about the six person teepee, it's gonna have eight guy out points and that's excluding the ones that are on the door. So that gives you some extra space in there. So if you guy it out, six person's a great tent. Um, you can have a lot of room in there, especially for sleeping area. Um, another thing to note is it's gonna have 22 stake out loops. So it stakes down really well. Um, they're a lot more often than on the Red Cliff. That's not to say anyone is better or worse than each other. They just have their certain advantages and disadvantages. Um, and then the, yeah, the door screens add 11 ounces uh, versus the eight ounces on the Red Cliff. But other than that, yeah, these are both great tents. So another key feature about both of these tents, they both come standard with stove jacks. Um, so then you can run a stove so that hot tent camping is gonna be super comfortable, super awesome. Um, they also have peak vents, uh, which allows them uh, to help with condensation a bit, kind of get some good air in there, get some decent airflow. And so that's the peak vent right there. And I'll go ahead and show you both of those on the Red Cliff here in a second as well. Okay, so here is the stove jack on the Red Cliff right here um, they're both located in amazing spots and then if you come over here um, the peak vent on this as well both of those are always going to be a standard on these two tents uh, make sure you get good airflow make sure you you can use this as a hot tent and just for reference for you guys i'm six foot tall 170 pounds so here's me in comparison to the red cliff it's a super well-sized tent and again, just for reference, here's the six person TP. I'm six foot tall, 170 pounds. So here's a comparison of the pack size of the Red Cliff versus the six person. The brown bag is the Red Cliff. The green bag is the six person. They're very similar sized. 
Um, door screens will make the packability a little less, so it'll it'll make the tent a little bit bigger. Um, but they're very close to each other. I'd say the six person is just a hair bigger, but not much that you'd really notice as far as packability. So just a couple things before I sign off. Um, the six person teepee is taller and slightly bigger, technically square footage wise, than the Red Cliff. However, it is a little bit heavier, so it comes in at a little bit of a penalty. The Red Cliff is a little bit lighter than the six person teepee, um, technically less square footage, but it's, it uses its space really well. They both sleep six people, um, three people with the stove. They're both great tents. Um, they all have slightly different purposes, it kind of whatever fits your needs the best. Anyways, thanks you, thank you guys for watching and have a great day. Bye. Hey everybody, links to all of our products are in the description below. If you have any questions, please leave a comment and thank you for watching.